world in Visual C++ 2005 Express Edition. You can use any edition you want, 2008, 2010, any future edition, the code language does not change. So you should be fine with any version of Visual C++ you have. So you want to start by clicking on File, New, and Project. Then you should see a window like this. It might not look exactly the same, but you want to select the option that says Windows Forms Application. Then enter your name. I will be putting in Hello World. It doesn't really matter what you put in. Then press OK to continue. It will then start to load up your project. This may take up to 20 seconds. Once loaded, you will see a small window. This is the going to be the window you will be creating your Hello World application on. It's still loading a little bit. Once loaded, you should be able to resize your window a little bit. We want to resize it to about this big. Now, go to your toolbox. Your toolbox will be on the left side of the screen, to the right side, to the bottom. It really depends on how you configured it. Mine to the left side. You want to find the control that's called button. Click on it and drag it onto the window. On your window. Now center it on the window. You want to right click on the button and click properties. Then find the value label text in the new dialog window. And edit it to say... Click me. This will not take effect until you press enter, so you want to press enter. Now you'll close this property window. Now right click on the empty space around your button and click properties. Once again it will open up another dialog window. You want to find the text value again and change the window name. Once again it will not take effect here until you press enter over here. So press enter again. Now you can see it's taken effect. Now you may cl close the property window. Double click on the click me button and it will bring you to the coding environment. This is where you can enter the code that relates to your design. If the program automatically puts you on a line with other code, you want to just press enter to get a new fresh line. You should be under this subheading, system void pu button one click. You should be un inside the two brackets for that. Now you need to type in message box colon colon show parentheses quotation marks hello world end quotations end parentheses and end with the semicolon always. This differentiates and one line from another. Once you've done, when once you're done entering the code, you want to go back to the design. Here you should see your window again. Once you see your window, you may click on the green execution arrow. This will start debugging your window, where you can actually use it. If you see a pop-up window like this, you want to say yes and we'll begin compiling it down here. Once compiled, it will open up a new window. Now you can see it's opened up the application in real time. Now we can use it. Now you want to click the click me button, you'll see that it opens up a message box, the code that we put in. And now it says hello world. And then you press OK to continue. Now you can press click me again, and it will open again and again. And there's no limit to the amount of time you can click it, and the application will not close until instructed to. So this is a simple Hello World C++ application. For more tutorials or information about Visually Basic, please visit www.visuallybasic.com.